We're going to turn now to that fiery plane crash in Kansas where a small jet slammed into a building at the airport in Wichita, killing four. We're learning more this morning about the pilot and what went wrong. ABC's Ryan Smith is on the scene with the latest. Good morning, Ryan. And good morning to you, George. The NTSB saying they're investigating, but the building isn't structurally sound, so they can't get in. They're waiting for the fire department to complete their work and deem safe this building decimated by this crash. This morning, a community reeling after a tragedy in the skies. It all started when a small plane taking off from Wichita Airport Thursday morning quickly lost power. This mayday call from the plane telling the horrific tale. The pilot losing control, veering to the left and crashing into this flight training building. Oh, we just lost that About 100 people trapped inside the burning building. Well, we were on a conference call. The building just kind of shook and rumbled. We saw the fuselage of the aircraft up on top of the building on fire. Only the pilot was on board, identified overnight as Mark Goldstein, a former air traffic controller and Navy veteran. He died in the crash, along with three people inside the building, which housed a flight simulator. Five others rushed to the hospital. One person still in serious condition. Goldstein recently retired, but twice earned top air traffic control safety awards. I would trust him with my life. The incident, the latest in a string of some very bad luck at this airport. In December, one employee allegedly tried to drive an explosive-filled van onto the tarmac. In January, a man ramming his truck into a security gate. But officials say Thursday's crash was not intentional, just a devastating misfortune. Once authorities can safely access this building, the harrowing part begins. Possible recovery of remains and determining the root cause. The irony here, people come from across the country to improve their flight safety skills in the simulators in this building, only to find themselves in the midst of an aviation tragedy, Robin. So tragic. All right. Thank you, Ryan.